Many people have been deceived by a teaching that is referred to as God's plan of salvation, where salvation is presented as a series of steps that you take to get eternal life. It goes something like this. You say the sinner's prayer and you must get baptized, some churches, and others you just need to join the church and now you have salvation. Dear friends, that is a lie because many people believe that they are saved but they don't know Jesus. Salvation is knowing Jesus Christ. Nothing else. You only get to know Jesus Christ when you go down on your knees and you cry out to Him until you get to know Him. You cry out and you repent of your sins until you are touched by Jesus. You need to spiritually connect with Him you will know that you've met up with a living God. And then you turn away from sin. You turn away from your former lifestyle. You become obedient to Jesus Christ until death. You follow Him and you obey Him. You become part of the kingdom of God. You submit yourself to Jesus. You obey Him. You're baptized in water. And He promised us the Holy Spirit that He will give to those who obey Him. And His Holy Spirit will guide you into all truth, will speak to you, will remind you of the words of Jesus, will teach you all things. You need to listen to the Holy Spirit. And you will not get the Holy Spirit, dear friend, if you don't obey Jesus Christ. Some people have received the Holy Spirit, but they're not listening. They're not following Jesus. They've become religious. They've become part of the system. Salvation is not a system, dear friend. Salvation is knowing Jesus Christ himself. Walking with him day by day. Seeking to please Him all the time. Being aware of Him. Jesus must be real to you. There is no plan of salvation. Salvation is knowing Jesus Christ and Him knowing you for real. And you must stay with Him until the very end of your life. If you desert Him, if you turn away, if you backslide, you are lost. You're going to hell, friend. You need to stay with Jesus. Salvation is knowing Jesus Christ and Him knowing you in a real relationship. Have you been deceived or do you really know Jesus? Do you walk with Him day by day? Do you listen to His voice and follow Him? Are you living to please Jesus? Get to know Jesus, friend, before it's too late. May Jesus bless you.